what is up traders welcome back to my youtube channel so in this video we're going to be looking at a gpp jpy pair right so um basically when i'm actually looking at this pair um it is sort of like moving um in a triangular state if i may put it that way all right that's how it's actually moving so what i'm seeing from this pearl is uh if i if i can just draw my resistance there and my support there right so basically what i'm seeing from this pearl is i'm seeing pearl this pearl wanting to to do something at my flip zone right here right as you can see that we've got this nice short um short term um bearish trend right so i'm seeing it wanting to do something there right and uh, you know if by any chance um it might come here right and then do whatever it does maybe manipulate and then proceed its move to the downward or come to to that um to that resistance or just um or just go down because as you can see here that this is sort of looking like an m right this is sort of looking like an m right like a lot of people got got in here when price was just reacting to this flip zone so a lot of people got in and now this might be looking like a stop hunt because you know the market might actually um, the the big banks might actually would have come back to this area to actually take out the stops of these people so it might be ready to just move to the downward but that is not all that you have to actually consider right that is not all we have to consider so as i'm looking at this pair we also have these opposing resistance i mean this um this opposing support right we also have this opposing support right here so you mustn't just look at things um one-sided way so we also have got what this support right here right and when i'm looking at price here i'm also looking i'm also seeing that price on this support it did act like it is actually breaking out from this support and then it came back and then it acted like it is sort of like retesting the support and then it moved to the downward and now it has formed some kind of like a w that the big banks might use to actually manipulate retail traders right so you know i, I feel like we're, we're actually at that level where you need to really really wait for your confirmations before you actually enter on a particular trade right so for me if you were to enter probably uh if you were to say oh, okay price is seeming to, to react from from this um from this flip zone then you might you might want to enter just a little bit long before you can confirm that oh, okay this right here is actually what this right here is actually my m and then you might want to do it and then you might want to enter there and then probably takes uh, something like one is to 2.4 risk to reward ratio right or you might want to wait for uh, uh, oh if price doesn't give you this sort of like m right you might want to wait for price to actually continue moving this w to the upward and then you might want to and uh, maybe wait for a retest right and then you might want to actually um buy this per right because here we are already seeing the the the, the famous pet in the w right and then uh this trend line basically does look like it has been manipulated this support right here right and also these flips on right here does look like it's being manipulated but not fully manipulated so you know you just gotta wait a little bit longer to see what the market does you know i always tell people to never you know try to enter in too 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 early because the one sniper enters they should actually wait a little bit longer for price to actually 
give them a clue on where it actually wants to go so that is it for for this pro guys so see you in the next video